All right. This is the fucking midpoint. Everything above this point is going to be difficult, so... Oh boy, I remember this level. Right in the butt cheek. Ah, yeah. <laughs> yeah, it starts you off with a fucking titan. Of all things it had to start you with, it just, it just had to be a titan, really. Could have, like, you know, had other things. There's, there's Scar, they exist. No, it had to be a titan. So this is, <laughs> this is really funny because this is like the first time we see a titan uh, that isn't in like a bossy kind of area. I mean the trench technically, but the trench is kind of a boss area in, to begin with. So yeah, t titans are no longer just bosses, they are now natural enemies that you have to fight. And they are fucking tough, as you can see, I'm fucking struggling here. Aww. He's just a little sleepy boy. <laughs> He's not dead. <laughs> Go below, guys. <laughs> anyway, so this Gandhi's supposed to die, uh, so he's not meant to actually do anything. If you do follow him, all he does is, like, run around. He was supposed to die, so... Yeah, he's like, oh, look, check it out. Check it out. Yeah, nothing. <laughs> Gandhi. Uh, more ammo that we can't use. Okay, let's use this for a little bit. Just to kind of waste the ammo. I like how they're both over here. Oh! Where? Where? Oh! Kind of remember that guy a little bit. Oh my god. There you go. What the fuck? Get out of my way. Our haven, the great sun spire, give us to us by the gods, by the good lore, has been corrupted by the sky demons. Our once by, our once hope it is now the full, foulest of terrors. The sky demons are stronger than ever. I have a vision of death, of imminence, uh, immense beasts roaming the land. Damn. Motherfucker went on a fucking poetry run. Holy shit. Give me them shoes. I need them shoes. I got me some shoes. Pachow. Pachow. I could have sworn there was a thing over there, but I guess not. That was fucking sick. Uh, Minions of our gods are cast down from the ground to do battle. We put the test of our world as weakening. It spews forth terrible creatures. We pray again tonight that our plea send the Messiah. Is that me? Am I the Messiah? I don't really want to be a Messiah today. <laughs> I want to be a node today because it's B. Right. Yeah. Okay. So they're giving us a lot of ammo, a lot of supplies, a lot of things. And you might be thinking to yourself, oh, well, this is just a supply map, so it's got to give us some shit. Get out of the way. Thank you. Oh, thank you. Okay, cool. Anyway. So yeah, it seems like, oh, yeah, it's a supply map. It's just meant to give you supplies. Uh, nope. This is a boss map. Yeah, I was about to say, you, you were supposed to be down here. I don't know why you weren't down here. Oops. So yeah, there was a Titan here. I could have sworn he was farther down, but you know, whatever. Titan here, if we keep going. Titan there, and then finally... Titan over there. This map is full of Titans for some magical reason. Uh, so the best way to deal with them is to just use the invisibility and get the fuck out of here because honestly like holy shit Oh you heard the explosion uh, 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 uh. Damn 
<laughs> I like how, I like how you just heard the explosion. I probably need to use a simpler gun for that. Something with a little bit more silence. I like how their idling is just them punching their own fist like, Yeah, I'm the biggest around. Don't fuck with me, bitch. I also like how this guy's a roamer. He just roams around. He doesn't have a script to just sit in a corner like these two and the other guy. So that's actually interesting how some of the Titans actually have, you know, proper mechanics, but some of them don't, which is really interesting. All right, let's save right here, and then we run for it. Oh, <laughs> that's spooky. <laughs> oh, shit. <laughs> <laughs> He's so mad! Why are you mad? I ain't do nothing. <laughs> oh shit! <laughs> it's so difficult, but it's actually really funny when you actually like uh, get them all on like one target. It's really funny, and I love it for that because it's it's so many titans for no reason. There's absolutely no reason for this many titans, but it's still funny as hell. I like how he didn't even see me. Oh, uh, until now. Whee! <laughs> I'm gonna take it. <laughs> <In the bed. laughs> see, they're me. It's me, IRL. Big, bulky, hulky man that throw rock. <laughs> That's me! That's my fucking spirit animal. I love them so much. <laughs> it's such a simple design, but it's so good. Uh, yeah, he's running at me, okay. No, you don't get to shoot me. Oh, he's dead, okay, good. You too, I see you. No, I just use the fucking. Goddamn. Save. See, so yeah, I'm not gonna kill those titans. They're too fucking adorable to kill. Like, just look at them, man. <laughs> They're like. <laughs> I love them so much. I like how they're both over here, too. Yeah. <laughs> Don't fight in words. <laughs> Don't fight in words. <laughs> Don't fight in words. <laughs> I don't like you. <laughs> I love this guy. <laughs> I love the Titan so much. He's so goofy. Are you okay? Okay. Sunspire. Now you could have seen that like in the previous map, but I like to see it here because it looks a lot better. Also, my mouse sensitivity was like really high for a second there. Okay. I will not return to the Sunspire today. I was uh, slain by the sky demons this morning, and I fear that our brothers are still not yet escaped. I feel that I will not see them again in this life. Poor Gandhi. They didn't have to kill Gandhi. Come on, man. Poor guy. Anyway. Good, oh, we good. <laughs> Alright, there's a guy over there. I see him very clearly over there. It's kind of easy, like, once you have, like, a big flat area to see enemies. Like, it's not very hard. So this is interesting. This is clearly a scar, but he doesn't see me, which is interesting. Oh. <laughs> you win this round. <laughs> he, but like, uh, back to what I was saying, he clearly doesn't see me, but other scar do, which is weird. So I'm wondering if this is like a lesser scar or maybe a scar with like less senses 
because he uses weapons and stuff. Maybe he's like a more sophisticated Scar and the other Scar is more animalistic where they're able to see through the invisibility. I know this guy doesn't see me, but it's still interesting that they don't see you. <laughs> Even the weapon goes kaplooey. I like it. <laughs> it's funny. Invisibility is really nice, though it is very limited. This is the same invisibility we had at the previous temple. I just didn't use it until the scar ship, but they can still see you even when you're invisible. So, very interesting right there. Anyway. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. <laughs> Fire's pretty. Anyway. Sun Spire. Oh what? Oh. oh <laughs> I like how he goes, oh my god, as he fucking falls in lava. <laughs> like he had one last second to say something, he was like, oh my god. Sun Spire. Huh. Ah. <sighs> take too long to die. So yeah, Sunspire is now overrun, so now we have to figure out why. Why is it overrun? Why does it have to always be over fucking run? Why can't we have villages with no scar in them? Explain that! <laughs> oh shit. You'll pay for that. Fucking got him! Let's go. All right, cool. Chamber of Honors. Hello. Oh, he's a normal gun, dude. All right, cool. He just killed him for no reason. Like, what the fuck? Like, I thought you'd kill him because like he's helping me, but no, he's just killing him because he can. Also, why is there fire in this one? What the fuck? Oh, 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 that's a big weapon. <laughs> I like that one. <laughs> yeah, there's fire in this one for some reason. This one's cool because it spins. And then this is not even connected to a backpack, even though it shows there's a backpack and the tube is supposed to go to that backpack. No, it, it doesn't exist. It's like, what the fuck? Also, where am I storing these items? Is this some weird, like, like hero plot armor bullshit where they just store it inside their ass or something? That's a lot of weapons to put up your ass, man. I don't think that's possible. I'm pretty sure. <laughs> Not entirely proven. <laughs> Might need Irene. <laughs> Irene needs to tell me. <laughs> maybe. <laughs> Not likely, but maybe. Alright, cool. Safe. Uh, Chamber of Honor. Hello. Thank you for the armor. I mean, this guy had something to hide, so maybe that was supposed to be scripted for this Gandhi, where it's supposed to give us the armor. And number nine ammo. Okay, cool. So now we have number nine ammo. Even though we don't have number nine, number nine isn't a part of this map. Uh, however, there is one weapon in particular that is here, but we will have to get to it. Uh, yeah, we just do that, and then we'll come back for that in a minute. What the fuck? I was hearing explosions, I just didn't know where. Who are you shooting at? Oh, I guess that was my own blade. What the fuck? Ow! Ha, ha, bitch! Oh, 
fucker shooting at me when I'm not paying attention. I heard a guy. I don't fucking know. Uh, Citrine. So, this is a toilet. Well, <laughs> you know what they say. There's always something in the toilet. I didn't even know it was called a citrine, but okay. <laughs> I thinking that is, a, I believe, a toilet. I can't remember what a citrine actually is, but I'm pretty sure it means toilet. So, there's a new guy here. This little monster. This is the pre evolution of the actual scar. This is Scar Babies, which is weird as fuck, but you know. So kind of like with aliens, how they had like, you know, face huggers and shit. This guy kind of copied that idea with these little guys. This is meant to be like Scar Babies or something like that. I mean, they look like Scar. I think there's a, like a note that says something about them being Scar Larvae. I can't remember. Anyway, so this is the, I guess, the toilet. And this is where all the doo-doo comes down, I guess. Okay. I don't really know. So that's an elevator. More ammo. Oh, it's in here. Another flare. How are you not dead? I like pumped them full of fucking things. Goddamn. Weeding. Great hall. Stupid. Anyway. Get more sludge. However, we won't need this sludge because over here, there's a lever. If you push this lever, you get the greatest weapon of all time. If you want to know anything about me, if you want to know one big fact about me, never give me a fucking minigun. Because <laughs> I'm going to use the fuck out of it. Let's go. Where them pussies at? <laughs> I'm going to blast their ass. Safe. Yep, never give me shrapnel and never fucking give me a machine gun. Specifically the machine gun. Because I fucking love machine guns. <laughs> Come here, bitch! <laughs> Die! I love the alt fire most of all, because it literally is just like an extra speed mode. <laughs> anyway, the minigun. It is, well, what it is, a minigun. You just fucking fire it and it shoots a whole bunch. If you hold down the other button, it fires faster. This is meant to be a substitute to the handgun because it uses the exact same ammo. If we fucking switch to it, there you go. Uses the exact same ammo, so you have an option between firing a whole bunch of bullets quickly on a target or being more precise. Being more precise makes sense because obviously with this one, it's precision and rapid fire. So now the rapid fire is useless because this is the new rapid fire and the speed upgrade really isn't that great to be honest. So yeah, I really like that. I like how you get a separate option from the handgun because the handgun is decent but it just doesn't do that much damage. The minigun does a lot of damage but it isn't good with precision. It's more for just fucking shrapnel control, you know, you just fire at a bunch of fucking enemies. Thank you. Okay, uh, so we are all the fucking way up here. Uh, let's go back down, actually, because I don't think we got all the shit. Nah, that's a lot of damage, okay. Let's go back down. Whee! Because obviously we fucking can go higher up, or we can go back and find the rest of the previous areas. Hi. Hi. 
How many enemies are here that I didn't kill? Man. Oh, you're up there. Wait a minute. No, that's, that's clearly the enemy. What the fuck? He's right fucking there. <laughs> what the fuck? Anyway. Oh, oh, no, it's this guy that we have to kill. The other thing was probably a body or something. Uh, so that's an elevator that goes straight back down. That's probably back down to the dark area. Let me go this way real quick. Let's see. Stupid. Alright, uh, yeah. How do I go back down? Ah. Oh, I'm gonna have to share. Got him. So where'd that other thing go? Oh, I think it went all the way down. <sighs> Call the elevator. <laughs> I have too little health. Safe. Uh, and then we go back down here, and I think this won't do that much damage yet. Ah, despawned. Fuck you. Alright, let's explore. So this is a massive area, so it's really difficult to actually get, like, all the items here. You don't say anything, okay. Cause like it's it's so big, it's like god damn, why is there so much shit here? Anyway. Safe. Safe. <laughs> it's like it's so many saves. Uh get our flashlight. Where does this go? Uh back down. Okay, so that's an elevator back down. Can't use that yet because we don't have any ammo for it. We can still use the handgun, it's just not that effective. So he came from over there. Safe. Ooh, ooh. Oh, it's an elevator, so this goes back down here. So everything just goes back down, alright. Ooh, new area. Oh, come on. Hey, just being silly. Oh, what the fuck? That totally hit you. Fucking, it didn't count for some reason. Wait a minute. Are we supposed to get the weapon or not? Because that's more of number nine. I'm confused. That's more of number nine, and I don't think you're supposed to get number nine here. Alright. Alright. 
turn? I don't think we're supposed to get number nine. I don't remember ever getting number nine here, but it might be here just because of all the fucking number nine ammo. Now this actually looks like a bathroom, so I, I believe this is supposed to be the bathroom. <laughs> yeah, bathing chambers. He's tall. Now this actually looks like a beast hall, what the fuck? I'll admit, I didn't really explore this place a lot as a fucking kid, so... Usually it's just go to the top area and then you're fine, so let me save here. There we go. You know what sucks? If you killed those, uh, titans, or if you tried to kill them, you wouldn't have enough ammo for this fucking place. Anyway, look at that. Bazoongas, zinga zoongas. Always nice. Uh, oh, shit. Oh my god, what do you want? Yeah, they give you a lot of fucking weapon ammo, Jesus. I guess this is where you're supposed to go after killing all those titans, because I don't remember this shit very much. I don't remember there being this much ammo, I remember it being a little bit harder. This is the kitchen. There's even more fucking enemies and I ain't got no health. Very interesting layouts here. Oh my god. They put Gandhi on the fucking cutting rack. Are they gonna eat Gandhi? Don't eat Gandhi, man. You don't get very good afterlife if you eat him. I should doll. <laughs> I've been there. <laughs> he was quite delicious. <laughs> I'm fucking going crazy, man. This game makes you go crazy. All right, let's go. All right, I think that's the end of this episode. Cause honestly, whew, I'm getting a little, a little, a little tired here. So in the next episode, we will continue forth. Cause I think we found everything. I will double check myself, but I think we found everything. So I'll see you guys next time.